by orders of Lord Gortash. Refugees are no longer allowed in the city. Turn around. Then go. Carl, you're in. Fascinating. Halt! By orders of Lord Gortash. Refugees are no longer allowed in the city. Turn around. Then go. Outside. How do you feel about Neville? This whole situation stinks. You might trek all the way there. Your brothers are usually disappointed. They take your gold, but they leave your rings. This is great. The place was empty. Keep those thugs away from my family. Denuvia! Get these spotters out of my house now! Arthur, sweetheart, you paid me and my boys to be caravan guards, not cattle wranglers. If you want us to get our hands dirty, it'd be our pleasure. But that'll be extra. I just want to remove these unlawful interlopers from my property. Stay here? What if the little frat gets into the basement? What do you mean by that? Shh, sweetheart. Adults are talking. This is guild business, and we'll handle it as soon as we get paid. Enough of this bickering! You! What's your proposal? Family motto, never trust anyone who works for free. What's in it for you? I never said anyone needed to get hurt, as long as they get out as soon as possible. But... Other than that, I don't care what methods you use. As long as you get rid of them, and fast, it's fine by me. I see you're a charitable sort. Perhaps you have some benevolence to spare for us poor souls. We just lost a load of gold thanks to somebody interfering in our business, you see. And now we're a little out of pocket. The Guild. A loose coalition unifying every criminal outfit in the city under one collective rule, from cut purses to contract killers. a little something. Consider it a gesture of goodwill. Oh, you know, it's shocking how many people opt for the hard way when the easy way is right there. Any last words?
you're serious. Let's forget this unpleasantness ever happened. Come on, boys. We've got places to be. Turns should do it. I bet I could hit that fancy one right on the nose. Pow! Heartless scum. I'm a reasonable woman. We could easily work something out in a house this big. ends well, eh? I'm sure the guild will be in touch with any concerns. But you said you'd get rid of them, and I believed you. More fool me. Well, with Zenovia and the others gone, I don't suppose you'll take no for an answer. All right, they can stay. Are you happy now? Now I have to figure out what I'm going to do. A room can wait. After what you've put me through, I need a drink. of refugees outside the city walls could easily become a surplus of laborers. Careful, Minthara. As a drow ex- Ah! Oh, the gods truly this petty! On my way.
Not everyone subscribes to what is mine is yours, it seems. It's been a long day. I'll need to rest soon. Can't talk just now, sorry. Let me have a little peace and quiet, won't you? Dog seems wary, sniffing you intently. The dog sniffs your hand and seems more at ease. I'm afraid I must insist you do not pet the hound. My love, you can't keep being so rude to strangers. It's just a dog. All the grabbing and touching startles, poor Biscotti. I will not apologize for caring about my boy. Isn't he just? I'm so very glad they let animals in the camp. Means Biscotti can be kept away from that awful war. Oh, yes. As long as the dog is okay, he's happy. Give me strength. I heard a curious sound in the night. What would you know about that, Shadow? Lady Shah permits me to plead ignorance. I ask not of Lady Shah, but of you and your paramour. I haven't the faintest idea what you mean. Perhaps a cat pounced on its prey. Brilgore fell to anger and rage, taking Father Logan with him. May Ilmata forgive him. Brilgore fell to anger and rage, taking Father Logan with him. 
may ill mater forgive him.